single day. All right, in here. No, we're open. They're already. Are they really off for Columbus Day? Seriously? No, you can still do it, dude. Do we? Yes. Oh, nice. Yeah. But that sucks, though, bro. I do agree. I do. I know they haven't seen us here. Oh, well. Yeah, we're in the foyer. We need to file an internal affairs complaint. Uh, Andy? This is a new filing. Uh, Matt Poland is here to file a complaint against uh, Keith Bush and Chad Walker for illegally eating his arm. Uh, all right, okay, thanks. Wow, finally, here we go. Uh, yeah, uh, we've been, uh, he wants to finally file the IA, internal affairs complaint. Okay. Have you been in touch with Captain Bote? No. Okay, he's reached out to you. Are you not familiar with the no. status? He never reached out to me. Okay. Well, I talked to him on the phone earlier and he said what? that he had. No, I haven't talked to him on the phone. Today's, today's a holiday. We're right. not part of professional standards for patrol supervisors. Cool. They will be open tomorrow, so if you want to so better to tomorrow. Uh, we, we, tomorrow. We can still fill it out today. Is there any way I can get out? We can fill it out today, and, and we can and he can sign it. You can. There already is an IA. It, no, I have to no, it. no, he's got to he's got to do it. I, my lawyer is telling me to file. Yep. Okay. Personally. Did you fill out the form? I oh, where is the form? No form there. You were here the other day. You know where the forms are. Right? No, they're not there. No, I do not. You got You handed me a form the other day. No, no. they gave it to me, sir. Yeah. They did. Yes. Exactly. Yeah. So let's be nice. No, but you were insinuated. Yes, it should, it should be in be there. there. Uh, we could not find it. It's not. Weird. I, don't I even it. asked them to put it there. They didn't entertain your suggestion? <laughs> I know. Can you believe that? Well, maybe they just don't want to have a phone. All right, Okay, so the red means everybody's body's camera's on? Correct. Awesome. So we can get that later? Oh, yeah. Absolutely. Awesome. Guys, where are Last time I was here, I asked for his, and I still haven't got it. Does it take a while? or? Got it. That's awesome that they have that, though. I, really I wish they had it the night that they ate your arm, right? Did you Have you seen his arm yet, what they did? No? Yeah, that's awesome. Keith Bush and Chad Walker. Yep. Got a little, got a little paranoid when they came to my house. Correct. Because I'm a big bad fellow. We have to get the form from Vegas, huh? Yeah, I asked them to put it in I asked them to put it in there. Can you get extra ones and put them in there? Right. Right. There we go. So, copies. Okay. okay. Just make sure you read all the instructions on here, okay? okay. Make sure you read the part where it cites a Florida State statute. You're going to put the description of your complaint in here. Okay. And on the back, it's going to be just follow the instructions right. on it. Whatever you do, don't sign it until you're in the presence of law enforcement okay. or a notary, okay? okay. With, Mr. Chiefs can direct yeah. you on that. Awesome. All right. Yeah, so he's going to fill out now because we, 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 he's, you know, he doesn't get a ride for tomorrow. So he's, he's going to be done here in just uh, like 10 minutes. Does anybody have a pen? Yes, he can. Yep. Yes, like he said, yes, I know the process. So yeah, he's going to fill it out, and then, uh, and then uh, yeah, we'll give it to you. You guys can check it, and we're done. When you're done, just pick up the phone and, and ask uh, for us to come back out. Correct. Take the information from Correct. Yep. All right. All right. All right, you got your pen?
Deploy the camera. Uh, yeah, we're out in the foyer. Uh, we filled out the complaint. They told me to call you to tell them to come back in to uh, so we can give it to them. Okay, I'll let them know. All right, thanks. You're welcome. All right, bye. Right, here we go. Uh, his statement was so long that he wrote it on two other papers and wrote attached. The phone just died. I can testify to that. Yeah, I can. I can charge it. I have a picture of it. Well, he can. He can swear under oath to that too, right? What, um, can you look him up? Some places ask them, no. They know who you are, man. <laughs> Correct? Correct. Do you know under Sunshine Law, can I actually see the screen that uh, comes up if you guys ran my name to see what it says, like if, if there's any warnings or anything like that? You can't get that? Only a lawyer can? I know. I would like to see what they got on you. They, they had to, like, I knew a friend that was a cop. Kind of right. Shit, right? Like, there's nothing that really said. He says, yeah, you've been in a prison. Because I got, well, I got an accident. He was late like, searching my car. I had an accident. Right. Because uh, I was a felon or whatever. Yeah, so I want to see what flags you yeah. got. Yeah. Yeah, because I heard on some of the people here you got a sovereign citizen flag. So I didn't know if... Oh, they, know if, oh, they hit me with known to have firearms, all that. They had that all written down on the thing. So wow. They, they Right. Wow. Right. And then when you're at Fallon and you get out of prison, they notify your community that you're in that area. So that's why they try to make everything a felon, felony, so they can ruin everybody's lives. Well, being a prior felon and you're not out for five years, they right. maximize. They, they hit you with a habitual felony offender act. They wow. Your points and then you do day for day time. You don't get no game time. And full order. Right. They're shooting for 71% mm. I know a girl, her husband got like 25 years. 25 years wow. isn't bad if you got 71%. Right. You do 85% of your time, you're doing 85% of your time. Like eight wow. And a half years. I did eight and a half years on that. And then I got caught with a cell phone in there and they gave me two extra. My game, it messed my game time up. Right. Wow. South Bay person. Is that true you really put the cell phone up your ass? No, nope, I had my buddy that did it though for me. Oh, oh man. Come on, man. Ah. Chargers and all. You know what they're doing now, though? Now they're kind of letting you do, get away with it because they have the cell phone sting, right? They're finding out they're everybody's saying it. Yeah, they yeah. said that when I was at yeah. I loved it, man. I mean, I got it. I went six years straight and I finally got a fucking phone. $350 I paid for a big old fucking metro phone. Wow. But hey, I got the, you know. Wow. I rode five months. I, I hit it for five months. But I had like a little cutout in my ceiling of my cell. Right. It was a cutout and we had tape. We put a greeting card and we paint it afterwards. And it would never, though, that, I bet you that spot's still right. When I got caught on my phone, I had it on me. But I had two others. I was like, the, the cell that I had had mm. a hide spot in it. Mm. I probably, it's probably still right. But right. Yeah, when I got caught, they never found the other cell phone. And years later, I got I got caught the phone, and then they transit shipping you my automatic immediate transfer. They sent me all the way up to Allen, but like Century CI. Wow. 
And then, uh, and I, I, years later, I found out that they never got the other phones. I thought they found the other phones in there. Right. But they never did. They had three phones in that cell. So. Oh we, my I, God. I had a docking charger, d- docking station, and then you would, you would unscrew the light and you plug it and it would sit in the light. You know, I'd have a docking station in my cell just show up. Sweet. Isn't that crazy? This well, now, like, they get, now they give you the, the now they give you the little uh, tablet. tablet. Cool. Yeah, now you get to yeah, they correct. Started, now you can right finally. Left, they had the MP3 player. Yeah. Fucking two ninety nine for a song. Bro. Yeah. I had a thousand dollars for just man. my little MP3 player. A thousand. I had like two over over eight years. Ago. Right. I had like two thousand songs on it. I'm like, this is dollars. I think that's where it comes back to policing for profit again, man. Well, you know that's really not them though, ain't it? It's like. Uh, it's They're getting a cut of that, dude. They say the rumor amongst prisoners is Keefe is owned by the Bush administration. Keefe is the big commissary. commissary. Right. And that's what the rumor was. Wow. Yeah. And then they say Bob Barker also owns, because uh, a lot of Bob, uh, uniforms and stuff are all Bob Barker. So they're saying he's part of the... Uh, it's what, are you, what are you talking about? The guy that's uh, on the TV? I guess. They have all the, pro, all the, the, the slides and certain uh, right. Bob Barker, that's what it is. They say it's him, but I don't know. That's just inmate.com, I call it. Right. Wow. Yeah. Are, they, are they doing it? So, so if they know that he's here, does it come up that you have to have extra cops? No? All right. Or if I'm here, there's extra cops. Hey, probably you. <laughs> I know. Am I the sovereign? <laughs> You're like the black slave when they have the Exactly. All right, they're all cheats. Are you doing cheats? We've got hot dogs. Yeah. We've got hot dogs over here. I have no contact with the officer, so I can't go to my stuff. Correct. Oh, that's true. Chad's not here, is he? Uh, no, no contact. Okay. Wow. If he's in the building, can he be here? Damn. Wow. Well, my neighbor was the was with no contact too. Right. So when I got out of out of bond, I'm like, well, I'm not trying to violate. It's my right. Neighbor. And my little my the, the husband's kind of he got hit by a car, so he's kind of crazy. So right. he always come to my house and ask me for a cigarette. And I'm like, hmm. hey, bro, you can't talk to me, man. We have right. no contact. Right. They call. They're the one that call the police. Wow. He was still coming over the house, and now the the wife, my 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 wife started buying those like, yeah, uh, you know them special shit that the women be selling, whatever it is, like the Avon cream and so whatever. Oh, all right, all right, Something right. like that. Well, my wife started doing that with her, and you know it kind of killed things. So I remember my wife had the baby just like literally. My son was like a week, two week old. Mm. So the neighbors who called the police knew they felt bad. Mm-hmm. The next day, she'd come over the next day, and I was in jail. I couldn't come by now because I was in the hospital. Mm-hmm. So they wouldn't let me go to first appearance. So I couldn't talk to none of my family for almost a month sitting in there. Wow. Because I couldn't get the first appearance because I had a wound back on my arm. Right. Wow. Yeah, wow, I was, wow. I only could talk to my lawyer. Right. I was cussing his ass out to me. I was like, man, you need to go to first appearance and on my behalf and get me a bond. Mm-hmm. Oh, I put it in. I felt emotional. Uh, so... I got out of jail. They put me in the holding cell in jail. Right. Cold ass fucking holding cell, one man cell, because I was, uh, they, they had me at risk because of the mm. hitting officer. Mm. They put you in a, like a, a different suit. You're wow. Like so even though it's not on the video. It's yellow. Even though it's not on the video. Oh, they didn't, they didn't care about the video then. Oh, all right. They didn't right. service then. Got it. But yeah, if I got convicted of it, I'd still have that same. If I got convicted of that right there, I'd right. go to jail and be in that suit. With wow. With the rest of the fucking weirdos. Right. Wow. <sighs> yep. Okay, whoever wants to go wherever.
Yeah, he, he, wrote, he wrote his story on the back of that because okay. it was so long. So those are the papers. I yeah, those are the back. original, correct. Okay. That's just the, same. That's the, That's same just the story. Uh, you want copies? Uh, yes, I have it. Actually, yes. Yeah, you got to give that to the lawyer, correct. Here. Huh? Correct. Yes. So was everybody off work today because it was a holiday? Or wow. So today was the day to commit a crime, man. I know. So do we really need them? <laughs> right. I do. I do admit this. Did you Did you hear about this, dude? They've been busy for the past two days. Do you, somebody, you shot, somebody killed somebody. All right. I thought that was here in Northport. That was Charlotte County. The kid that stabbed. I thought that was Northport. That's right over off of Gibraltar. Seriously? They're trying to pass. That was my friend's little dog. They're trying to pass a law. You commit more than twenty. You seen that? Right. You commit more than twenty crimes, whatever. You know, you shouldn't be left out. Whatever, but he was, wow. He was fucked up, that little kid, that, that boy. But that, that's the problem. That's why, you know, I do what I do. Everything's illegal, man. You know what I mean? Like, if I took the book, Three Felonies a Day, I could literally go to his house and charge him with stuff, but they won't let me charge him with stuff, even though he's committing three felonies a day. That's what the book says, right? What's up with that? I don't get it either. Why, do you like to read books? Yes. Uh, do you ever heard of the book Three Felonies a Day? Yeah, there's a, there's a guy that wrote a book, uh, uh, Dershowitz, a good, the best lawyer around. Everybody's committing three felonies a day. There's so many laws in the book, including them. So here we go. We got copies. Awesome. All right, and can I just point, make one more? So can we have them put? We would have filled it out. They were right. Yeah, and I asked them to before, and I, I come here all the time, and they're not there. Seriously. I'll give them records. They were previously there. So. All right. All right. We're all set. Thanks. Lord, I haven't seen it in a long time. I've been fighting this one for a long time, but when you listen to the report and you watch the video. Oh my God, these motherfuckers lied their ass off. They need to be sued to hell. By the way, they are still trying to get uh, uh, Matt uh, uh, on all these charges that I listed. Even though that the uh, report does not match the video. We had a dash cam video of coming this way before. Uh, they tried to erase his uh, DVR uh, video of his cameras of his own house right here. And uh, can you believe the uh, public... Uh, Defendant got it back with forensics. It's insane. So that's Matt right there. And uh, there he goes. Boom. On the ground. Um, so I'm going to do a screen read. Uh, you watch the video and you're going to see these fucking cops lied their ass off. They need to be charged. They need to be put in jail. Uh, Matt, you need needs to be paid, I'd say, a half a million to a million for this insanity nightmare of years. By the way, that's what his arm looked like. This is what his arm looks like now. Uh, his He is disabled in this arm because they had to take so much meat. They almost had to take his old arm off because a dog had weird-ass germs in his mouth. <clears throat> Remember when our founding father said, take a goddamn country back before it's too late and it's almost too late. You are a frog in a pot and it is boiling. Wake the fuck up.
On October 16, 2017 at approximately 2,300 hours, I responded to the area of 21, Broncusi Avenue. In reference to a occupied burglary in progress call. The caller advised that. Whom he identified only as Matt, broke into his house and is possibly on drugs. The. Caller continued to state, hurry up, get here. The subject Matt, who will herein be. Referred to as the defendant was ultimately positively identified as Matthew Poulin. While. The caller was on the phone with telecommunications, the defendant exited the caller's residence and went into the street. OFC Walker No. 342 and OFC Bush No. 258 initially made contact with the defendant in the street. In front of this location. As OFC Walker was attempting to speak with the defendant, the defendant began to laugh and walk away from OFC Walker. OFC Walker advised the defendant that he was being detained and that he could not leave. The defendant then turned around and shoved OFC Walker. At that time, OFC Walker was forced to take the defendant to the ground. The defendant began to resist OFC Walker by shoving OFC Walker in the chest trying to escape. The struggle then ensued. OFC Bush yelled to OFC Walker to get off of the defendant so that he could deploy his department issued C.E.W slash taser. OFC Bush deployed his department issued C.E.W, however it was ineffective in restraining the defendant. The defendant was continuously trying to escape from officers. The defendant also attempted to bite officers while squirming on the ground and pushing officers off of him. At that time, I arrived and noticed the defendant on the ground while OFC Bush was continuously giving him loud, verbal commands. Along with OFC Bush, I gave the defendant loud, verbal commands to roll over on his stomach and to place his hands behind his back. The defendant then replied, fuck you. At that time, OFC Bush and I approached the defendant to attempt to place him into handcuffs. The defendant was yelling, rolling around, and not responding to any verbal commands. At that time, OFC Walker left from the struggle and retrieved K-9 Dutch from his patrol vehicle and brought Dutch to where the defendant was. OFC Walker gave verbal commands to Dutch to apprehend the defendant which was successful. The defendant attempted to choke Dutch in the process. The defendant was still shoving officers off of him and trying to get away by scurrying around on the ground, not allowing himself to be handcuffed. The defendant was yelling and cursing throughout the incident. The defendant was trying kick officers and grab officer S hands. Eventually, the defendant was placed into handcuffs after a long struggle. While in handcuffs, the defendant was uncooperative with the fire department and would not answer their questions. After the defendant was transported to the hospital, SMHNP, the initial caller declined to pursue charges for the burglary of his residence and signed a complaint withdrawal. However, based on the aforementioned evidence, I find probable cause exists for the crimes of battery on a law enforcement officer, resisting slash obstructing an officer with violence and offense against a police dog. These crimes are described in F.S.S. 784.07, 2B, 843.01, These crimes did occur in the city of Northport, Sarasota County, Florida. Hey, Sheriff County. This is Sheriff County Cop Watch. I am using any video here with under fair use. If you uh, have criticism, reporting, teaching, etc., and please donate. I do not make money from YouTube, and uh, there are different ways to donate in the uh, video links. Thanks.